Nick Airsoft 14 coming at you with another Airsoft Gun Review video. Phil can't be here today, but I'm here to fill in. Today we got the UTG Master Sniper Rifle Generation 5. In the stocks comes a three point slip resistant sling, three fully adjustable butt pads that screw in right in the back of the gun right over here, two 30 round capacity clips. A cleaner and unjammer rod for the gun if it ever needs to be used. And the gun itself. The gun came in two pieces the upper receiver and the lower receiver. They were completely attached in the box. The upper receiver is fully metal, while the uh, lower receiver is plastic, with the exception of the trigger guards and the lower rails, as well as the sling mounts right there. Alright, they also came with uh, this tactical bipod, which is attached right now, but um, it does not have to be attached. Folds up just like that. You got to screw it in. We already did that. That's how we're using it. Um, some pros of this: it shoots about 450 feet per second to 500 uh, with 20 grams. So that's really good. It's effective up to quite a long range. We haven't got the specifications down on that, but it shoots really far. Um, it's not very heavy at all for a sniper rifle that has a lot of metal parts. I mean, I can pick it up just fine. Hold with one hand, just like that. It's not heavy at all. Um, it's got an adjustable hop up on this side right over here. You just gotta move back and forth to your liking. Um, it's really got a good feel to it too. It's got some grips right here on the front grip and the bottom grip. The cons of this, the bipod works very well, but it is a little bit wobbly. It shouldn't really cause a lot of problems, but I mean, you know, just a little bit wobbly. Um, the bolt, it's bolt action, fully metal, and it's a little bit hard to pull back. You have to pull it up, go all the way back, push it forward, and lock it back in place. A little tough for younger players, so watch out for that. Um, there's really nothing else bad about this gun. It's great. We've used it in several battles. Comes in handy picking off people on the field. That's pretty much it. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. We've got more videos coming at you, so stay tuned.